Welcome back to Hayes Hounds, episode 24. Today's preview will be going through the Group 3 South Australian Oaks and Derby Angle Park tonight. Um, so let's get into it. Race 1 run with Box 5, Fantastic Radley. Um, he's been in very good form recent, um, unbeaten over at Murray Bridge over the 680. He drops back in distance tonight. Um, he will be racing over the uh, 600, or the 595, sorry. Um, and I think he'll be able to lead all the way um, in his 680 runs. He liked to lead uh, throughout the race. He wasn't a come-from-behind dog. So dropping back in distance, I don't think that will hinder him too much. So expect him to continue his purple form that he's been in, um, and he should get race one. So for race one, I've gone with box five, Fantastic Radley. Race two, there's plenty of maidens in this one. Um, and going with box four, Springvale Rex, um, Looking, going through his litter, um, most of them have ran low 30s, except for one who ran 30 and 40 um, in a trot, in a race, sorry. Um, if, if hopefully he can follow his litter mate's uh, footsteps, and if he can, I think he will be a clear winner here. Um, the other litters, uh, the other maidens, their litters just don't seem as strong. Um, a lot, not more, many of the litters have had many dogs running over the 400, so, um, a bit of question marks about most dogs here, but I think uh, Box 4, Springvale Rex should look strong here. Race 3, I've gone with Box 8, Influencer, who was good on debut, um, just unlucky last in his last run. I uh, expect him to bounce back here and prove too classy for most of the dogs in this field. So for Race 3, I've gone with Box 8, Influencer. Race four, and it's only a four-dog field with Shadow Miss Scratch. And I'm going with box one, Stout Manali here over Dan uh, Rushes in box four. Um, I just think Stout Manali is uh, more of a liable beginner. Um, they're both pretty similar um, since uh, Stout Manali's been in w uh, South Australia, should I say. Um, but I just think he's the more reliable beginner with box one. That should help into his favours, so... For race four, I've gone with box one, Stout Manelli. Race five, I've gone with box four, Daniels Charlie. I think he's the classy dog here. Um, he's definitely the one to beat. Um, I'm hoping he can improve on last week's run and hopefully can run a mid-30. So if he can do that, he should be able to win this race um, and take out race five on the card. Race six, it's the group three, South Australian Oaks, as I said earlier. Um, and I'm going with box six here. Um, she's a hot shot with zipping decoy scratch. I think that improves her chances. Her run last week was good considering it was her first run over um, past 400. Um, and I think she'll be able to improve and hopefully uh, can go one and get this victory. So for race six, I've gone with a box six as she's a hot shot. Race seven, it's very hard to go past fly for tricks. Um, has, was running all right in Vic. Um, and I thought her run for second last time behind Stout Manali was very good. Um, considering it was her first time uh, racing in South Australia and obviously first time at Angle Park. I'm sure there's plenty of improvements to come there. Chimera Manali, I think he's more suited to the 600. He's got a big motor, just can't sort of get the starts right. So he'll probably look to run on late, but I just think Fly for Tricks will prove too strong here for in race 7. So for race 7, I've gone with Box 8, Fly for Tricks. Race 8 is the Group 3 South Australian Derby. And I'm going with Box 1 here, came and went. Um, thought he was very good to beat uh, Gemtree Maximus. And uh, with the inside draw, I think he gets the better of him again. So I think he'll run a strong enough race with Box 1 that will also help him. So I'm going with Box 1, came and went in the Group 3 uh, South Australian Derby. Race 9 is a pretty even race and there's plenty of early speed on the card here. So going with box 7 here, uh, Spring Drama um, with an inside vacant draw in box 6. Um, and, the, and box 5 Velocity Fairy should uh, get out really well and should uh, sort of make the race for him. So for race 9, I've gone with box 7, Spring Drama. I'm hoping that can jump uh, with Velocity Fairy. And hopefully uh, Velocity Fairy can clear the way for him. So if that can happen, I'll be very happy. And hopefully uh, Spring Drama can get up. So for race 9, I've gone with box 7, Spring Drama. Race 10, I'm going with box 5, Dark Tides over Victor Kurt. Uh, Victor Kurt will look to start better. 
um, and hopefully give uh, Dark Tides the clear run that he needs early on. Um, Dark Tides will obviously run a stronger race and he'll probably hit the line a bit harder. So I'm expecting him to hopefully um, stay within a length uh, of Victor Kurt going down the back and um, he should be able to get him if so. So for race 10 I'm going with box 5 a Dark Tides. Race 11 I'm going with box 2 uh, Korong, Kurong Cash. Um, he's been racing really well over the 4.55 at the bridge and um, he's had a couple starts at the old Angle Park track so he's got a little bit of experience over the distance um, and he's can't, he'll look to get on the rail early. Um, he's got a reserve on his inside so he should prove too good here. Um, so for race 11 we're going with box 2. Race 12 to round out the night and this is a case for me of whoever leads out of Defy and Hot Spartan. Um, I just think whoever leads will probably go on to win this. Um, Hot Spartan, I think, will probably start the better. Um, he, he looks to be the stronger dog. Um, and I, I'm hoping that at worst comes to worst, he's no more than a let back um, going down the back. So if so, he might be able to get him. But I'm hoping he'll be able to lead um, going around the first turn. So for race 12, I've gone with box 8, Hot Spartan. This week's Heath Hound of the Week was Poa of Buddy. Um, he was able to break the 400 metre track record at Warrior on Tuesday. Uh, he ran 8.13 to the first split and had an overall time of 21.99. So he was able to break the track record at uh, Warrior and he's Heath Hound of the Week. Episode 24 of Heath Hound, South Australian Oaks and Derby Preview.